Good afternoon, everyone. Bonjour tout le monde. Thank you, uh, Mayor Nenshi, for your kind words. Uh, thank you, Emerjeet, for your kind introduction. It's a pleasure to be here in Calgary with you all and Minister of Transportation, Brian Mason. I know Minister Mason announced he'll be retiring after this term, so let me add my congratulations to the many flowing in on 29 years of service to the people of Alberta. I'm also very glad to be joined here today by such a strong voice for Alberta in Ottawa, the Minister of Infrastructure and Communities, Amarjeet Sohi. Avant de commencer, je tiens à souligner que c'est une journée tragique qui marque le cinquième anniversaire de la tragédie de lac Mégantic. Nos pensées sont avec les familles des victimes et tous ceux qui ont été touchés par ces événements terribles. Mon gouvernement est déterminé à veiller à ce que la sécurité des chemins de fer et de toutes nos infrastructures demeure l'une de nos grandes priorités. Today is the fifth anniversary of the tragedy uh, in lac Mégantic and we are reminded of uh, the lives lost and all the work we need to continue to do to make sure that our infrastructure and our communities are as safe as possible. Whenever I'm in Alberta, I'm reminded not only of the beauty of our country, but of its vastness. Anyone who's taken a long road trip or sat in traffic during a lengthy commute knows that building roads is about more than just putting down asphalt. It's about connecting Canadians to their families and their jobs, connecting our resources to markets around the world. And that's why we're investing in Calgary, a city that's growing. Building infrastructure here supports communities as they expand and thrive. But today, I'm proud to announce that as part of our National Trade Corridors Fund, the federal government is investing $50 million dollars in the Calgary Airport Trail project. These funds will help construct transportation infrastructure along Airport Trail. This vital artery gets people and goods to and from Calgary International Airport, a hub for tourism, trade, and the local economy. Airport Trail also connects folks in, to their communities and to commercial areas in the northeast of the city. This project will make a real difference in people's everyday lives, which is why it has such strong buy-in from the government of Alberta, the city of Calgary, and indeed, the Calgary Airport Authority itself. Thank you, Bob. Because working together means better results for Canadians, like growing our economy and creating jobs for our middle class. And today's announcement is just one more piece of what my government is doing on that front. A couple of weeks ago, we were here to unveil a major investment of up to one and a half billion dollars for Calgary's Green Line. That's the largest contribution ever made by the Government of Canada to an infrastructure project in Alberta. We're listening to the needs of people across the province. In May, we committed more than 39 million dollars to the 50th Street Railway crossing in Edmonton improvements that will reduce congestion and travel times and increase safety. This project is expected to create nearly 900 well-paying middle-class jobs. It's a win-win. More efficient travel and good jobs for Canadians. At the same time that we're developing infrastructure so people can get around, my government is also focused on strengthening our economy by getting Canadian resources to global markets. That's why we took action to make sure that work will go ahead on the Trans Mountain Expansion Project protecting thousands of jobs. Because it's essential that we grow our economy and protect our environment at the same time. Soyez assurés que je veillerai à ce que les Canadiens et les entreprises canadiennes disposent des infrastructures dont ils ont besoin pour faire leur travail. Notre gouvernement investira 10.1 milliards de dollars au cours des 11 prochaines années dans les projets de commerce et de transport. Nous continuons à faire des investissements ciblés pour créer des emplois, aider les familles et faire croître l'économie. C'est une stratégie qui fait une vraie différence dans la vie des Canadiens. Today's announcement is a great example of what we can achieve in cities and towns across the country when we invest in infrastructure. By working with our partners at all orders of government, we can help people spend more time with their families, grow our economy, 
and create jobs for our middle class.